Chief Executive Officer and President of Dale Earnhardt Incorporated, Teresa Earnhardt Nee Houston, was born on the 20th of December 1958 in Hickory, North Carolina in the United States. She is the widow of the professional race car driver, Dale Earnhardt, who died in an accident while participating in the Daytona 500 race in 2001. Dale Earnhardt has been inducted into a number of fame halls for his great achievements in sports. After his death, he was inducted into the NASCAR Hall of Fame in 2010. However, Teresa Earnhardt has been involved in the racing business since 1996. So, just how much is Teresa Earnhardt's net worth? Under the latest estimations by Celebrity.Money, her wealth as the Dale Earnhardt Incorporated owner is as much as $55 million, accumulated partly by her inheritance from a deceased husband and from her ongoing business activity in the car racing world. Teresa Houston is the niece of the retired NASCAR Bush Series race driver Tommy Houston. She studied at Bunker Hill High School, then majored in interior design and commercial art. She debuted as the head of Dale Earnhardt Incorporated during the Bush Series in 1998, prior to which she guided the company during two championships of the Craftsman Truck Series, respectively, in 96 and 97. Later, she led the company during the 99, 2004, as well as 2005 Bush Series Championships. It was a paradox when the team, guided by Teresa, won the Daytona 500 Championship in 2001, when Michael Waltrip won, as it was the same race during which her husband died in a crash. Of course, heading the company was financially profitable and added considerably to the size of Teresa Earnhardt's net worth. However, the death of her racer husband, Dale Earnhardt, caused a lot of trouble with sponsors, as both the Army of USA and Budweiser withdrew their support, which led to Earnhardt Racing and Chip Gansey Racing, with Felix Sabet being united. So, in 2008, the new team entitled Earnhardt Ganassi Racing was announced, and the team managed to win the 2010 Daytona 500 thanks to the perfect driving of Jamie McMurray. In 2004, the biographical drama film entitled The Dale Earnhardt Story, directed by Russell Mulcahy, was released. The racer Dale Earnhardt was portrayed by Barry Pepper and Teresa Earnhardt by Elizabeth Mitchell. The film was nominated for an Emmy, Screen Actors Guild, and Art Directors Guild Awards. Currently, Teresa's activities are less public, as in 2014, she was bought out of the racing company by Chip Ganassi, as he believed that she was no longer interested in or of practical use in the operations of the company. Finally, in the personal life of Teresa Earnhardt, she started dating Dale in the late 1970s and the couple married in 1982, the third marriage for Dale Earnhardt, whereas for Teresa, it was her first. But becoming the stepmother to Dale Earnhardt Jr., Kelly Earnhardt Miller, and Carrie Earnhardt. In 1988, she gave birth to their daughter, Taylor Nicole. They reside on their farm near Mooresville, North Carolina. Her husband, Dale Earnhardt, died during a racing accident in 2001 because of a bacillar skull fracture. At the time of his death, he was 49 years old.